Oh, absolutely fantastic race and, and so close, uh, you couldn't call it. Um, and the, the result, gold silver for, for GB is absolutely fantastic. Um, from my perspective or our perspective, we'd quite like to, to have been the other way around, but you know, that's, that's life and, and Duncan accepts that as well. I think in his uh, post-race interview, he was just so gracious in defeat, um, you know, giving praise to his, to his teammate. And he was happy that you know, his teammate got gold and he, he's happy with silver. There's other chances for him this week to, um, to go for gold again, so fingers crossed for that. He was about eight, eight or nine, um, and he'd been swimming with his dad at Troon um, just for fun, uh, joined the swim team. He's uh, just such a nice young man. Uh, you know, you could tell when he came in, he's just so, always a smile on his face. Anything you asked him to do, he would do it. And I don't remember him ever complaining, um, but, you know, it, it just, you know, you could see from the very start that he wanted to swim, he wanted to race. Uh, his sister was in the squad as well. She's two or three years older than him. Um, and you could see him looking across the pool thinking, I'm going to beat you next, you know. And, and I think he's um, he, he's made mention of that before. And uh, Alex is such a nice um, sister uh, that take, took that. And, you know, it's just um, all the time that he was with us, he was only with us a year or two. Um, but as soon as he was in the, in the squad, we had him in the uh, West Coast Mini League team. Uh, and you know, anything you asked, any stroke you asked him to do, he would race it to his very best. And you could you could see that from such an early age. I mean, you, I don't know that you would pick out and say, oh, he's going to be an Olympian. But you could tell that he had he had a good um, a good style to his stroke. Um, most strokes he he was um, very good at. Um, so you know you could you could see that um, with a bit of uh, refining he would he would become a very very good swimmer um, and I think the the commitment of his parents uh, has has helped him to become that. You know, so. uh, he moved he moved from uh, Trun uh, to Alloa uh, and then he, he swam with. Um, I have Falkirk or First or uh, one of those um, squads. So I didn't really see anything else about him until the Commonwealth Games in 2014, where he medalled in the he was in the um, in the relay team, and he got a medal in the relay team. And his sister got in touch. I'd already uh, seen it and thought, oh, I know him. <laughs> you know, uh, I used to coach him, not thinking, you know, that um, that the praise would would be part of our um, our own um, responsibility but you know once once he'd started on that road you could see him just getting better and better um, and it was nice to hear him in um, interviews in newspapers and things like that crediting some of the things that he'd learned way back when he was that age uh, down in uh, South Asia swim team.